What's up guys, so before this video even starts, I just want to talk about something. So this is something that I've been thinking about and something that's just been on my mind and been present in my life recently, at least for you know, the past few weeks. But that's just, it's just, I'm going to talk about the act of doing as opposed to the act of wishing. My clients, like, you know, they have this... Even people in general, they just have this very toxic view and toxic, you know, even just saying it out loud, just toxic things that they, they say about themselves. For instance, like, you know, some will say, oh, uh, I wish I, I wasn't as fat or I wish I had a better job or something like that. But like, for me, it's, you know, over the years, I'm like, oh, like, don't, you know, don't think like that, like, blah, 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 like, don't, blah, blah, blah. But, like, I just, my patience has gotten so small with this because, because now, now I just say, well, just do it. Just lose the weight. What are you waiting for? Like, or just get a good job. Like, it's not, and it's not like I'm trying to be an asshole. Like, I understand it's, it's difficult and all this stuff, but, like, the amount of time and the amount of energy you waste you know, just even saying it, just proclaiming it out loud, like it's such a toxic energy that you're saying and and when you keep saying it and saying it, that energy just becomes what is for you. Like you attract uh, not getting a good job when you keep saying, you know, I'm stuck in this job, I hate this job, blah, blah. You'll keep tra attracting that. When you say that you're fat and, and you know, this weight is coming off so slow, like, you keep attracting that. When you actually want something, and when you actually want to make moves, when you actually want that thing to become reality, you need to do it, just do it. And that starts with day one, it starts with working hard. You know, you can't just say, I want this without putting in the work, you gotta put in the work. And this is just something that's just on my mind, because it's, for me, it's just so toxic. I've been hearing it for years and for years, and it's just like, just stop and do it. Stop and do it. And realize that you can do it. It's not something that's un unattainable. Like you can do it. Okay? I, and you got and everybody knows like it's difficult doing anything, but you won't know until you try and you won't be able to do it until you actually start doing it. So that's just something I had to get off my chest like, you know, quit Quit with this negative mindset that you have and start at least with positive acclamations, positive positive things about yourself like wake up today and look at yourself in the mirror and actually look at yourself with positive meaning instead of looking at your imperfections because we all have imperfections but look at yourself with positive positive reinforcement like look at yourself in the mirror and say hey good morning gorgeous we're going to have a great day and mean it like mean it if you even start doing that, I guarantee your whole mindset's gonna change and good things are gonna start happening to you because you actually want it. Okay, you want it and you start doing it, okay? And I'm sorry that I'm rambling here, but I just, I really wanna hammer home this point, like, start today by doing what you want and doing what you envision. And envision positive things. A lot of people say seeing is believing, but you need to be able to see what you want. You need to be able to see that end point to get what you want, okay? I'm blanking on the Wayne Dyer quote right now, but I'm just gonna put it right here. But you need to believe in yourself, you need to believe in your goals, and you need to believe in the end goal, okay? You can't, you can't just go wishing away, okay? Do it, start doing it, guys. Yeah, that's that's pretty much my ramble. I just, you know, it, it gets, it eats up inside of you and, you know, eventually you just, there's nothing you can say to someone that can give them that motivation to start doing it, okay? There's nothing you can do. It has to come from that person. They have to take the action to do something, okay? I can, like, for perfect example, I can motivate my client every day. I can say, you can do this. You can do this. You get yourself to the gym. You eat healthy. I believe in you. That all means nothing. It's all bullshit. If that person doesn't even do it, if you can't motivate yourself to do what you want, what the fuck am I going to do? What the hell am I going to do? I'm sorry I'm swearing, but like, what can I do to help you 
if you're not willing to help yourself, okay? Hear that out loud. If you can't help yourself, no one else can help you. And that goes for other things too. I can't help someone if I'm not believing in myself. I don't believe that I can do whatever I set out to do, okay? I, that's just how it works. So my goal every day is to make someone smile, make someone happy, and that doesn't happen unless I smile, unless I want to be happy, okay? And I understand that there's never a perfect moment where you're happy all the time, and we're always chasing for those happy moments, and that's okay. But just realize that you need to work on yourself before you can work on others, that you need to start doing instead of wishing, and that you are in control of everything around you. You make your reality. So thank you for watching this rant. Let's get to the video at hand. Happy days. <laughs> and just start doing today. Set small goals for yourself and just start hitting them. And so you know it, you're checking off the list. You're checking off the list. You're checking off the list. And then you, before you know it, you're hitting your goal. Okay? So without further ado, Here's the video. Be well, be good. Peace. Have you made a lot of money out of your music? Money. I mean, what is, how, much is, how much is a lot of money to you? Yeah, that's a good question. Have, have you made, say, millions of dollars? No. Are you a rich man? What do you mean rich? What do you mean? Do you have a lot of possessions? A lot of oh, money in the bank? Possession make you rich? I don't, I don't have that type of richness. My richness is life forever. Have you made a lot of money out of your music? Money. I mean, what is how much is how much is a lot of money to you? Yeah, that's a good question. 
Have, have you made, say, millions of dollars? No. Are you a rich man? When you mean rich, what do you mean? You have a lot of possessions, a lot of oh. money in the bank. Possession make you rich? I know I don't have that type of richness. My richness is life forever. <laughs> happy rainy 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 day today is Tuesday I had a freaking amazing workout it was awesome legs and shoulders I was sweating like a pig great workout now I'm gonna go get a haircut but first let's do a cool edit of this rain let's do it now Man. What's up guys? So we got the haircut. Again, Dan did a great job. Fairfield County, Frank's Barbershop, asked for Danny, does great work. Check him out. Anyways, I'm gonna go home and eat some pizza. So we'll see you all there right now. Baby, you look happier, you do. My friends told me one day 